You've seen him on The Tonight Show, HBO, Letterman, and of course, the star of one of TV's most popular sitcoms, Slapstick. Nice intro, huh? What an intro, boy. And I never even met that jolly little prick. <laughs> but he comes up here and he introduces me as his friend. Mmm. Yeah, isn't that beautiful, though? Only in Hollywood. Ladies and gentlemen, a man who uh, I admire tremendously. A man who is a great entertainer. No, no. I am his friend. Why? Hmm? Probably because he's trying to impress a girl so he can get laid after the show. Hmm? Is there anything original happening in this town? If you want to fit in, you got to get a tattoo. Pierce your tongue. Everybody's doing it. Look at this. Two drink minimum. Four drink. Six. Doesn't matter. You'll pay it. Oh, yeah, you'll pay it. Anything to get your mind off your boring fucking lives. <laughs> Sheep love to follow. So they don't get blamed when things go wrong. <laughs> wow. Hey, where are you from originally, motherfucker? <laughs> I played a lot of clubs. I played a lot of places in front of a lot of people. I must say, this is the most pathetic looking group of shit I ever saw in my life. <laughs> and you're laughing, you fucking asshole. Look at you. Keep laughing, you scumbag. Laugh. Isn't that wonderful? I wish my manager were here tonight, Russ Klein. This is a different kind of show. We want everybody to be happy here, Matthew. You know what I mean? Uh, of course you do. And I look out here and I wonder, what am I doing here? Because I remember the very first day I was born. That's right. Number one. I was lying in my crib. And I should have never got out of that fucking crib. <laughs> You like that, don't you? That's funny, isn't it, Frank? You like that? Yo, look at your old lady over there. She likes it too, doesn't she? A lot of schmeck in the audience tonight, don't you think so? <laughs> <laughs> you know, ladies and gentlemen, I recognize a lot of you people from that favorite show of mine, which I guess you all remember. It's called Slapstick. How many of you remember Slapstick? Yeah, well. We need to get out of that box. You know what I mean? Be in person, look at my fans, talk to them. I feel a little something coming over me right now. It's a little, a little song that I heard some years ago, and it describes my feet. <laughs> they are so different, so free, so living in 